Okay, testing one, two, three. Uh, yeah, anyone who may be seeing this yeah, now or later. Oh, now it started streaming. <laughs> okay, that was a bit wasted. Uh, anyone seeing this now or later? Uh, yeah, I'm Alien. Uh, typically, I stream games, but yeah, I got my hands on this thing recently and I decided I might as well close the door so I don't bother too many people outside the, with this. And uh, yeah, I thought I might as well record me building it. And a friend of mine asked for pictures of it anyway, of me building this thing anyways. So why the hell not? But just to show that my voice is not the only thing being listened to, this should start. This should be royalty-free music when it starts. There we go. Let's see. For anyone curious, this is from royalty-free royalty -free musicradio.com on the positive pop uh, chapter with that. So, okay. Let's pop this thing open. Hopefully the cameras are situated well enough. There, that should cover most of this. Let's see, model number 71391. And yeah, it's one of these big ones, so we have to pop these seals. Which I'm using a pair of tweezers. It's better than a blade, but it still cuts just as easily into these. Okay. And no need to go for both sides. Uh, let's see. Yeah, of course, a lot of these. Okay, these are solid pieces. Works, of course. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, my. The, cam the second camera is over here on top of the... Typically, my headset hangs from that, but now it's my previous webcam. See another one of these. Sorry, again, it's set on top of a stack of games underneath here. Yeah, I'll try not to hit it too much. Okay. There's going to be quite a bit in this. And... Uh, of course, we need. There's no physical manual, so everything will need to be done through the app. Okay, there's at least 10 bags. I'm not going to port all of these. Let me make that 13 bags. I'm not going to port all of these on the desk here because there's way too little space for that. But I will bring them all out for now. One of them going down. There's still more to go. And there's a dump, two number sevens. And that, okay, number one is a little tiny. Probably the Goomba Captain, I'm thinking. Also, I'm not planning on making this a typical thing. I already have more than enough Legos built around. And yeah, I, I just plain don't have the space to have too many more okay yeah this is a lot of bags then again this is a big build okay and the final one okay that is them all okay now to order them Let's see we have number one here there's number nine i'll put those yeah behind here Number one, number three. Music is changing. Sounds a bit. Or not, it was just going soft for a bit. Number two. Number eight and seven. Actually, that's number four. Okay. Let's try to keep you all in order. Hopefully, the crinkling isn't. Too much of an annoying sound. 11, 13, 10, 6, 12, 13, and this is number 4. There we go, all in order. And yeah, <laughs> just a tiny first one. Is that actually described here? Nope, it is not. So this thing can go. And in the meantime, I'll be opening up the app. 
On the one hand, it is nice that... Let's see, where is it? There it is. On the one hand, it is nice to have all of these manuals digitized, but physical ones would be useful as well, because, yeah, if you if your phone is completely out... And, oh, sorry, I did it again. And unlike Britney Spears, I'm not easily you know, forgiven for that. Okay, start that. In the meantime, I'll pop this open. Yeah, I very much doubt we'll be using this. Unless I really make a dumb mistake. That goes into the box for removal later. Let's see, yeah, it is. Oh, not. Actually, it's a Monty Mole, not, a Goom not the Goomba Captain like I thought. Okay. Uh, let's get to you here. Connect. I yeah, need to put you on, of course. Come on, connect. I'm pretty sure... I don't actually remember if you need to scan them with him to uh, get the, the manual started, but might as well. You can just stand around here overlooking things looking like a freaking demon on the you know, recording. Uh, yep. Lego Mario needs an update. Uh, let me... Oh, what the fuck? Uh, okay, I'm moving this a bit. There we go. Yeah, it should be a lot less bumpable. I'll also move this aside. It probably won't come into use for quite a while. Okay. Okay, he is updating. I'm guessing that that's done already. Let's see. Current track on the positive pop radio is Flight in a Dream. Okay, and the update is done. Uh, right. Where was it again to add things with this thing? It has been a bit since I... Uh... Ah, there we go. Plus, and then... It should be at the back here somewhere, because it is one of the latest. Or actually, it is... This. Now, there it is. Okay, starting off with the, the Rocky Mole. Of course, yeah. Might as well put it here to give people some of a look at their instructions. Okay, that one right there. And the upper side, of course. Some reinforcements in the middle. And these for the arm side connecting pieces. One up the front for the face, which comes immediately after. Okay. Code thing at the back here. It looks odd. It looks different in their instruction. Okay. No, no it's just that for some reason the, the phone has an issue displaying uh, barcodes like that. Okay. That goes onto the side here. Okay. Uh, it's supposed to uh, mimic the wrench. Actually, I think I just did it on the wrong side. Yep, I did. Not that it matters too much. And then just this. This. And of course, the only other thing to follow up possible, possibly follow after that is this. And there we go. One Rocky Mo uh, Monty. Okay, done. Okay, so we do have to scan him. Okay. Out of the new set. Let's go. Neiman Mario can keep watch over everything. <laughs> okay, Kamek is next then. And of course, he's going to be in bag number two. Go. Small thing. Uh, oh, okay. This is probably from the cannon. Okay, there we go. This will, uh, this will, won't, this way won't, yeah, this way black pieces won't be hidden against the rest of my desk. Okay, plastic away. Okay, this little thing. 
Okay, keep them apart. Um, as well. Okay. There we go. Blue. Put these aside. Current track on the radio is Best Friends. Yeah, all of these tra tracks should be royalty free, so I should not be getting any annoying strikes with this. It's that. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Three or two. Uh, there and there. That's going to be for one of his arms, probably. Same on the other side. <clears throat> okay, let me pull up a bit more. And then the two by three to reinforce it, keep it in place. Okay, this is just going to be the same with the next step. Yeah, the instructions won't be too visible for anyone watching like this, or at least the details won't be. But yeah, little I can do to that now. For some reason I thought it would come with a physical manual, but uh, yeah, shows how dumb I am then to have forgotten that. Okay, arms, then something for, to hang his face on. And this. Okay, never known what these pieces are called. Or what people refer to them as. Dip in the audio again for some reason. I really don't get why that happens. Okay, mouth and nose into place. Yep. Keep your face on, Kamek. The cheeks. There we go. Okay, putting that aside. This one, and where is that? Okay. Then the glasses. And there's the second one. Okay. Okay, feet. And the QR thing. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. Then for his hat. Okay. Where is this? This looks a more like a granny from uh, the Paper Mario games. Oh yeah, now it now it looks more like she was. I think she was, she was dressed in purple as well. Yeah. That, current track. It's gonna be all right. Just in case people want to look that up. I hope the audio isn't too unbalanced with this. But oh well, little I can do about that now. Some runs. And there we go. Comic done. And yeah, the rest of this is going to be for the cannon, probably. Actually, let me put that aside. Okay. Oh no, his broom is still. Of, of course, his broom is still. <laughs> Yeah, what would we can't what what would Kamek be without his broom? Just another magic Koopa. Okay, these two on top of this. <laughs> no, don't put it on the wrong way. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Let's see. This is there. Two of these. This is a pretty clever use of these pieces to make a broom for him, I'd say. Alright. Current track horizons. This is pretty good music, I must say. 
and immediately it dips again. I, I really do not know why that happens. And a, a barrel for the <laughs> for the end of it. Okay, and that's the that's it done. Okay. Let's put you aside. Actually, you can't stay. You can't stay up like this. So let's put that down next to you, and let's make the cannon. Of course, this needs to go underneath it for it to stand up. Yeah, not the brightest at times. I will fully admit to that. There he goes. Okay. Another new track? Okay, okay, I'm not I'm not going to be able to keep track of all of these tracks. Whenever a new one pops up. Okay. Never know what these were supposed to be called. Okay, put these on to probably to secure something in place. Circle and one of these. Probably going to mimic that on the other side. Of course. Right there. Okay. Step one done. Well, first part done more. Okay. Put this on top. Probably keep this more in sight of the... Okay, that's a bit bad with that. Yeah, <laughs> showing the parts that are needed is really shrunk. Okay. These two. And probably just going to mimic that on the other side. Okay. Yep. So I might as well put these on these and put them in place in one go. There, yep. These on top. Reinforcement to keep it all together. And then, yep, this on top. And there we go. That's the second bag done. Okay. Oh, that, yeah, that's a spare one. Okay. Let's put all of these aside. You can use the cannon for that. Okay. Now, next bag, and that's going to be the Captain Goomba. Along with the start on the airship. One, two, let's put that aside for, actually, let's not just yet. Yeah, there, there's always going to be extra bits like this, but we don't need to have a bag ready to keep those on the side yet. There you go. You. Okay, spread this out a bit so we can actually see what is what. And you're going to need these bits probably. And these. Because all of these Goombas are mostly made the same. Okay. Footstep, feet, and these. This is always mirroring the other side. Yep. Then this one at the back. Okay, they typically don't really done two times with shown with this. Okay. I really don't get why the, the volume of the music is going up and down. I hope it's audible enough. I, 
Let's see, let me just do advanced audio mixer and then monitor. Hmm. Let's up that a bit. Okay, up three decibels should be enough. I hope at least. Okay. And still it shows that happening separately. <laughs> okay, not well, too well thought out, people. Base. And there we go, as always. The barcode, and now for the hats. Okay, starting off with one of these. This on top. On the side, of course. One, two. Hmm. Isn't this supposed to stay on top of his head? Isn't that going to move? Oh, oh it's upside down. <laughs> okay. It's going to be on upside down. Like this. Yeah. That's it already. <laughs> okay. You go join the others. Let's see. What is this then? I have one of these little flying platforms. Okay. Start with this special piece. Go. And of course on the other side as well. Underneath. Okay. There's that one. Okay. I personally prefer to have the, the barcode things match up with the uh, instructions. Okay, let's see. Two from the side. Okay. And now for the propeller. Okay. Let's see. Then this one through it. Still, again, no idea how these are supposed to be called. I personally think bars is the most likely. Take the cross beam and then another of these extenders. And then yet another. And we still have two more to go. Okay. Washing bin on top. That just puts you in, keep you in place. And then another on top. Okay. Is this an extra red then? Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> okay, there we go. There. That's halfway done. Now, is that going to... Nope, that's not going on the top of that yet. And another double, okay. Probably starting with these. Yep. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. So, okay, one, two, three, and a four. Bit rough, but oh well. It's not like I'm going for a hyper precision with these things, anyways. There you go. 
there you go. And then these pieces for to finish off the propeller. Oh, oh, come on, if you're, if you're going to sh say that it has to be done twice, don't literally show it being done twice. There we go. You go on top here. There we go. And that's that done. I'll put you over here at the moment, sort of out of sight. And only two extra pieces for cannon. Uh, yeah, a bit early to make photos of these. I can make just anything. I'll make a photo whenever. And now we're getting to the. Okay, that is going to be a long one when we get to that. Yeah, I'll, I'll start making pictures when we get to the. for my friend. For when we get to the main airship part. Of course. Next bag. Okay. Now we're getting to the big pieces. We would you. Move you up a little bit. There. And there. Okay. You out a bit. Separate you. Those are going to be the fingers. Make sure nothing is being hidden underneath something else. Because that is an absolute pain in the neck. To find anything like that. Okay. 2x4 and a 1x6. Why am I getting an itch here now? Okay, 2x4 perforated. Two circles and one of these odd things. And let me guess. Not actually just mirror on the other side. Okay. Or are you going to mirror it now? Nope. Instead it's going to be this one. Okay. One Two, three, and four. Okay. Next up, up even more of those. Okay. Wait. Oh, this is going to be the. F yeah. This is. This is going to be the fist. No, you don't. You're not escaping. There we go. And yeah, make the fingers three times. One, two, three. Wait, right, there's four. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. There we Okay, and red pieces on the other side. I need three, not four. <laughs> okay, then it's an easy guess for that these go on top. Yep, as well as those little capstones, okay. There, there, where are they? There they are. One, two, three. Okay. 
Yeah, that, that looks a lot better. Okay. Yeah, now for the rogue last one. Oh, come on. Oh. Seriously, if you... Lego, if you're going to put it at time three next to one of those, just... <laughs> don't have it show three times anyways. Kids aren't that stupid. A lot of adults are probably that stupid, but still. Uh, no thanks. It's uh, trying to ask me about the subscription now. No. Uh, the royalty free music, that is. Hmm. Uh, if it stops playing, I'll just uh, move on to another place that I know where you can find free music. Though it'll, it'll cause a lot, a few more interruptions because I'll have to swap between each individual track. going to be the thumb. Cut off by the same little nail bits. There we go. And down the middle. Okay. Then what goes on top of the... There's nothing going on top of those. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, just a ghost hand then for now. So weren't those things used as anchors in the games? Okay, moving on. One by fours. Top of the another of these special platform pieces. Okay. You go in between. Hmm. Let's see. I believe this is going to be another of these floating platforms. And again, with a dip with the music. Uh, I, it might just be their way. It might just be an annoying thing they do to try and get people to get a subscription to this. In which case, oh yeah, I'll just not use this again in the future. Okay. Let's get you in the middle there. Yep. Let's Two of those. Sides here. There we go. And ah, this one, the brown cap bar. Cap bar. Okay, entirely through. That's just for stability. Well, security. Securing it in place. Two by three, two three high. Right, one by two. One of these ramps. Okay. One of these and a two by four. And then a flat. Yeah, not really completely flat. It's one of these uh, trapezoid pieces. Okay, what are you for? Here we go. Remember to keep my back somewhat straight and not lean over too much. So that's going to cost me in a decade or so, probably. That's. And where is. There it is. And even more of these on top. And 
And another of these. Okay, where is this? Where are you going? You're going straight on top. Okay. Is something is going to have to go on top of that to balance it out. And let's see. Yeah, long enough. And then with one of these. Okay, this can always be a bit annoying to get them into place. Check. Come on. There we go. And then to the third hole into this to keep all of this together. And yeah, next up is not to secure it on the other end as well. Okay. Instead, we're taking these. Okay. The smaller one goes on top. This one and this one. You are not falling off. Not on my watch. Number three. And then number four on the other end. Okay. And then two of those in there. I'm sort of curious how long this is going to take in total. That's in part of why I'm uh, streaming slash recording this. And yeah, if nobody watches, well, no skin off my back. And let's see, what are you uh, at the end here, okay? Then the other one goes on third in place. Thank you. And get in there. Don't fully push it in until the other pieces or other parts are partially in as well. There we go. And it all snaps in one go. Yep, you almost snuck away. There we go. Cap it off. Where are you going to be then? The capstone at the top. <laughs> okay. Now for something else. Okay, another propeller thing from the looks of it. Actually, yeah, there's enough pieces here for that. Yeah, this is going to make another propeller. There we go. Then another at the end. And yet another. Yeah, big, bigger platform or more a platform with more stuff. Would of course take another, take a bigger propeller, or in this case at least a bigger mast for some reason. And then this one. Okay, crow's nest on top. And you are going to be capped off with... not yet. Now with there only being two reds left. It's an easy guess where the last one is going. So, there we go. Yep. And you are not going on top of theirs yet. Okay. Oh, well, we already know how to make these. So, one, two, three. Four, five, and six. And then the final part looks a bit like a miniature Millennium Falcon. Okay, one, two. Come on. Okay. 
And there we go. <laughs> this might actually work better in putting them together. Okay, let's skip through here. And there we go. An angle. There. Now what is going to attach to this? Because there's still this bit here. Okay. I guess... Oh, wait. Ah, that's not on directly. It's on off by one. Bye-bye. Uh, Actually... Yeah, don't disturb. There we go. And that should keep any messages from popping up. You are going there. Okay. This and the other black bar. Where are you going? The target on top. And this. Yellow and then black. Uh, you are... No, you're not going on there. Oh, like that. Okay. Um, that's underneath, I th from the looks of it. Yep. And that's this one done. Oh, okay. Hmm. Okay, I'm not looking at the uh, in interaction videos. You can go over here for now. Okay, this should be the last one. Actually, we have two of these big ones. Uh, these are just platforms to put them on top of. So these can go like this. Actually... Or not. Oh! They connect to this. Uh, let's see, that is to the back here. Let's zoom that in. Is that... Yeah, that's four out. One of these on. Okay, and that connects with this one. To make one big... Okay, bit of a shallow connection between these two then. And then... Okay, still leaves that, and they want Captain Goomba on here. <laughs> okay, he might as well go on then. Take the helm, Captain. Okay, not really necessary to do this, but always nice. And we have only two extra bits like this. Uh, yeah. Let's put them aside. We're, we're putting them in the next bag. Go. Never a good idea to discard any of these because you can always build extra little things. Yeah, very weak connection there. Already coming loose. It, uh, this should have been. This one should have been done with an extra long piece. Just uh, two longer on. And the claw goes. Oh, it goes on here. Okay. <laughs> and you are separate from that. Okay. And that's the first piece done. Quite nicely, I'd say. And now we're getting to the main attraction. So this is... Hmm. Luigi, move aside for a second. And it's already falling apart. <laughs> okay. 
Actually, let's have you loose so you don't fall off but when I move it. Though it's already coming apart again. forward where there's an actual bit of support underneath you. And you want to come forward a bit. Usually that's going to fall. So Monty, you're a cornerstone of this ship. Okay. Come on. There we go. Okay, my driven get back. Okay, come here, you. I want it let loose over here. But oh well. Don't fall over, you old fart. Okay. Mm -hmm. yep. Sorry. There, and... There we go. Bag number five is up. Okay, this is going to take up quite a bit, and it's asking for the big pieces. Extra pieces. Let's see, these two for the back, probably. And then these. Okay, yeah, this one is going to be pretty big. Of course, it's going to be that's the last, it's the biggest piece in the series release. So, and um, yeah, this is sturdier than the rest, so all of the spare pieces are going in here then. Go a bit oversized for that, but oh well. Better over than undersized. Okay, off to the sides. Let's have a fan blowing here that would otherwise start pushing at it. Okay. Small bits. Off we go. And the big boys. Three as well. There. Yeah, my desk has this indent in here, so yeah, my fat gut can be here and have my arms on the desk like this without a need for armrests, which would get and run up against my desk anyways. Okay, two of you and the middle piece. Immediately put on the bow. Oh, well, it's getting a bit complicated with these, right to me. Two of these. A third. Four of these. There we go. And then one, two, black, two by four. Let's see, you are going there, and then one of these, corner pieces, Oop. I said I would try to not have that happen again, and it still happens again, okay, outside, corner, Hopefully they'll make more big yeah, more things with these kinds of big uh, ship parts. Because uh, yeah, on the side camera, you can see that I have the big one of the older, um, it's not older, but another ship uh, set, which is uh, individual parts. And uh, hello there in the chat, big trucker. <laughs> Starts hiding blobs in the carpet, ties Helene shoelaces together through his chair. <laughs> yeah, good luck with that. No laces. 
I'm a lazy fuck. And yeah, the carpet is fully black, so if I dropped any of these, I'd likely uh, not find them back here. <laughs> or at least not without feeling around. Okay. One, two. Yeah, actually, it's times four of those. And then these two. Okay. So, uh, how are you doing, trucker? Things going well on the roads over there? There, and you there. And I missed one of you here. <laughs> yeah, of course I cheat on my footwear. I'm, I'm lazy. And plus, these things are just freaking comfy. Even though, uh, yeah, one of my feet is like half a centimeter shorter. So, yeah, one of these is a bit loose. So it always freaking is... I typically don't really notice it, but it gets annoying when I do start to notice it. And yeah, having... Buying two pairs of shoes that are just because to have one smaller... Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Or really allowed. It's... I get ones who are, that are work wear and non slip Also works. And yeah, it makes a lot more sense in your profession. For anyone uh, guessing. Uh, yeah, the name says it all. Okay. Uh, since you're jumping a bit late, oh, actually it says it in the title. Uh, yeah, this is Lego and Chill, me building Bowser's airship. Already built uh, this little bit here. Uh, Mario and Luigi are already owned. I actually pre-ordered Luigi. Because, yeah, I'm a sucker for Lego and Mario. And then we have Kamek here as well on his broom, which he keeps falling off of. Okay, these. Now, where are you going? Okay, third peg. And then a copy on the other side, it seems. Let's see, my grandmother had to buy two pairs. She had a brace on one leg due to a stroke. Oh, yeah. Sorry to hear that. Okay. Yeah, maybe I should just put some something, a bit, a filler thing or something in my left shoe. Oh, so is the music coming across decently? This is uh, royaltyfreemusicradio.com. So yeah, I should, emphasis on should, not get any uh, trouble from the YouTube bots and such. And I don't know why it sometimes dips in uh, audio, in, in volume. Okay, to another piece and another double. Okay, and yet whilst it does say that you should do these twice, it still shows you twice. About as loud as you, okay. Uh. <clears throat> no, you don't. Uh, okay, I'll lower it a bit then, since it's supposed to be background and such. There we go, how's that? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six. One in between, yes. Okay, odd. Let me lower it a bit more then. Is it actually having an effect? Let me lean under here for a bit. Not that. Oh, that is making it louder again. Uh, 
Okay, this manual then. This better. Uh, there we go. These two. Get in there, you. There we go. It shouldn't have been as loud because the, on the volume mixer it shows up as being a lot softer than me. Actually, 15 decibels softer at the moment. There we go. Of course, again, it shows a double. So. There we go, and that is all going in here. Uh, let's see. Alongside this. Okay, just need to get all of it drawing up. There we go. Yeah, this thing is a bit more complex than the ship over there. Okay, now we're just doing the other side. Okay. This again. And we can immediately go to this one. Where is your other half? There is your other half. Okay. Thanks for pointing that out, by the way. Uh, these. And the same on this side. Which way was it again that it's... It has to stick out. Okay. There. It's going in the immediately next to it. And these again. Okay, normally you'd be asleep by now, eh? You know, just having a rough night or something, or free day tomorrow? Hmm. So, because, yeah, over where you would be... Actually, you're in America, so it'd be... Around seven or so? So, yeah, just up early, I'm guessing, then. There. And there. And, yeah, in the same place. But opposite. There we go. That's the first stage done. Okay. These. This is going to be mirrored. No, it's not completely going to be mirrored. Okay. And then this one here. I almost bumped the camera again. Uh, yesterday was out in heat trying to help uh, work on my truck, pushing my limit with pneumonia recovery. Uh, yeah, but good luck with that because uh, I won't be able to do much help from, with that from here. But at least I hope I can provide some entertainment. Let's see. Okay, oh, it is being mirrored. It is, the other part was hidden behind the instruction or the requirements. There we go. There. One by six with holes. Find it. If it wants to go in, of course. 
Okay. Yeah, at, at the very least, with this, you only have to watch and not really do much. <clears throat> there we go. It's you two and this one. And there we go. Okay, try piece. Oh, yeah. if, if you feel it's better to go sleep, go sleep. And no need to stay up and uh, hurt yourself for my sake. And now the site is complaining about subscription again. To which the answer again is no. People listen to royalty free music specifically not to have to buy alliances or anything. Come on. Get in there, you. Come on. Come on. Two of you want to go in at the same time, but not all three. Let's reverse this a bit then. Put you there. And get you there and push there. There we go. Annoying things that it can be with that sometimes. Okay. Two doubles, two by fours. And one by six high. Perforated. Okay, you're just up. Uh, well, again, uh, hopefully I can at least provide some entertainment then. But uh, I won't blame you if you fall asleep at this again. <laughs> there we go. Oh, now he wants this big piece. Okay. Uh, there. And now we're going to copy that on the other side. Of course we are. There. One, two. One and three. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome to watch any time, of course. I've almost lost this piece, even though it's massive. Okay, one arch piece in the middle there. Yep, and then a bunch of these. Okay, let's see. One, two, these. Let's see. Let's start with you. These two. Hopefully I'm doing a reasonable with the, with the camera. I should probably hold this th these things over here a lot more. And that's too much to decide. There. That's a motor in the background. Hmm. Okay, what are you? Hmm. Okay. And yeah, that's going on top of here because this thing slides in and out of itself. So when are you going to come back and fix my lawnmower? Uh, yeah, uh, the moment you can get me a cheap chicken ticket to and fro. Okay. 
come on. Get in there. And then this one there. Yep. Now the same other side, the same. And there we go. <laughs> yeah, the people at LEGO are always clever with designing things. And we have only one spare piece. Let me double check. Yep, yeah, all of these have them. So this one is spare and I still again bump this thing. Okay. Yep, time for the first photo for the friend. There we go. Come on. Yeah, this thing needs replacement. I, actually, I already have a replacement here. But yeah. This is the one that has <laughs> this one. Uh, Okay. For a moment I thought I'd accidentally reset it to the start. Okay, back into place. You, you, off to the side. And box number 6 of 13. And that box bag. Now oh, come on, didn't you hear my unemployed until the dark it gives me a new mad card? I actually didn't hear that. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh... Or if I did hear that, I forgot, because yeah, I'm prone to forgetting things. Okay. Sacrificing some of our workspace. There we go. Now, let's see this thing and this one. Goes in the middle. These little things at the ends. What are you going to become? Okay, these won't be on too securely, but I'm guessing that is why there's space there. It's so one, two, three, four. Five and where is the last one? There you are. Okay. And of course it comes off because it's only connected at one point. There. Might as well pull you off. Because you would fall off anyways. There. Now, how are we going? Yes, I. There we go. Cover pieces. Yeah, I don't plan on me doing making this a regular thing. I just had well this big, this big box over here, and uh, yeah, decided I might as well record me streaming, at least record building it, and see if if anyone is actually interested in this. Let's see. Two of these, one of these, and two of these. Okay. There. Okay. Some more one by six. Okay, and then to finish this off, I have to say it's not bad music that they have on this. There's still a bunch of other stations that they have on offer here. Okay. This, these, and another, or no, two more of those. Okay. I don't 
don't go in upside down, that won't fit at all. Yep, stay on you. There, there, and there. Two big ones over here. Four of these, and then two of these, because they have to be, well, they have to pass over each other without, uh, wait, did I miss? Yeah, I think I'm, yeah, I missed these two in the corners here. Okay. Mistake corrected. And there. Okay, and that goes on the back. Yep, plug these in. Come on, go through. Come on, get there we go. And now you in come up there. Let's see. Let's get you through those separately then. And then there. Yeah, these things here, they could have replaced they probably could have replaced those with you know just a single piece instead of two thin separate ones. Okay. More at the back here. One, two, three, and a four. Okay, what is that supposed to be? Another double? Okay, start off with these. Starts on top of each. And another cap piece on top of that. Okay. I have no idea what these are supposed to be. Yes, yes, we already told us that we need to build that twice. Hmm. Okay, are these supposed to be sort of safeguard between the meat pieces? There. What do we make with the rest of these bits? Uh, that. Twice again. <laughs> Let's see. I'm guessing you're going to start... Nope. With these. Okay. And next up is probably... Yep. The right pieces. Okay. There and yep, this one next. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So 
So, yeah, I have absolutely no idea what these pieces are supposed to be or represent or anything. I'm guessing they are just supposed to keep parts for, apart from each other. Let's see then. Of course, that's the second one, so we can skip right through. Oh, with the propellers. <laughs> yeah, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah, yeah, part of you might be thinking, but that's, that's pretty smart oh, for what it's going to need seven more yeah, banks. Well, yeah, there's going to be quite a bit to fill in, I think. All of these extra pieces that are going away. Bag number seven. Okay, another photo. Come on. Yeah, one of my friends currently has uh, computer issues. The power supply of their computer you know, is broken and they can't afford a direct replacement. Or rather, they've sent it in for repairs, so it'll probably be away for over a week or so. That's seven. You're taking up more and more space. Less small stuff. Probably a good thing. Nothing left in the bank. Guess that can happen from time to time, is that something will just be stuck in there in a crease. Yeah, but the power supplies is yeah, they don't have a lot of money though. And yeah, I don't know the specifics of it. It could just be that the space that they sent the place that they send it to is just very busy. Or or it's just that uh, yeah, you have to pay premium to get uh, up front or something. Hmm. Yeah, maybe maybe I could uh, send them enough money to buy a new power supply, and then they can have this other one as a backup. Though it could also be the case that they come back with the diagnosis that the thing won't work at all anymore. It's but yeah, a sparking power supply is something you don't want in a computer. Because, uh, yeah, it <laughs> that could sort of fire if things were to go wrong. That's you, yes. Let's see. That's a good thing that you got this stream. And that is... Yeah, black on black. So where the heck are you, doodles? There you are. It's, shi it's shinier than the rest of the carpets. So that's where it is. Uh, anyway, so as I was saying, uh, it's a good thing that you caught this stream and not one of the previous ones of Impossible Creatures. Because, uh, yeah, things got uh, frustrating with that. Let's see. If it... Uh, if it... Is it... Is it I don't know what market it, what brand it is. Heard they have been sling some defective ones lately. Okay, I'll have to ask them after this. Yeah, because if it is defective, he said it wasn't too old. Maybe he could... Actually, that he probably sent it back in on, on warranty. That's probably what uh, happens. It, and it wants another bow piece. Which means that we're going to repair, repeat this on the other side. Yep. Hmm. Uh, yeah, if 
if Gigabyte is selling uh, defective materials, then he should be able to get those repairs for free. But that would also explain why it's going to take forever to actually get it dealt with. Yeah, personally, I have personally I have my computer underneath here. I have a second one downstairs for VR in an open space because yeah, just look at this room is almost a closet. It's a big closet. Uh, and beyond even that, I have enough parts to possibly make a third you know, uh, PC. Though I don't think I have a power supply or case for it. I, I know for a fact I don't have a case for a possible third one. And most of, most of those things I just have because I haven't been throwing away or selling old pieces. Though I did I did send one of my old motherboards to a friend in New Zealand because, uh, yeah, their, <laughs> their motherboard fried itself. Let's see, Gamer Nexus on YouTube has uh, for all recent videos about it. I'll try to keep that in mind and send that to them as well. Because, uh, yeah, they've been uh, having it a bit in the shit lately and being... Du and yeah, thus being restricted to only. Did I put on the wrong color with this one? No, is being restricted to only a crappy laptop is not going to do their mood much good. But yeah, if they need it, I could send them some stuff to uh, help tie them over. Though I wouldn't buy him a complete new computer or anything. <laughs> that is a bit... Out, it'd probably be within my price range, but it it would leave me broke. Problem is that a bad power supply, especially sparking, can fry the CPU, motherboard GPU, yeah. All the more reason to have it repaired. Well... <clears throat> Again, I'll... I'll look that up and send that uh, through to him. See if it can help him. Go the other piece. Did I put these on the wrong side? Yes, I put these on the wrong side. There we go. Okay, small things. Yeah, personally, I have one of those. Um, I think the abbreviation is IPU, uh, Independent Power Units or something. Personally, I have one of those between my computer and the uh, power, but that's only going to protect it from power surges coming up the system, not from the power supply itself, from not from its own power supply or its uh, power converter. I believe technically the term would be more accurate. It doesn't matter too much. There we go. There. This goes there. There. Just reminding myself to have this in sight. Come on, stubborn little thing. Oh, something just got ejected there underneath. Uh, UPS, uninterruptible power supply. Yeah, thank you. Uh, next. These pieces. Go there. And there, they're leaving space for something here. Uh, you're coming loose. No, you're... Come on, get back on there. There we go. Okay, where is this going? Hmm. It's going to be some sort of figurehead. Or is this going to be a stop piece or something? A 
UPS maintains power, but a bad power supply can destroy your computer completely. Yeah. Now two of these, right? And for some reason, those aren't showing completely in... One, two, three, four, five, and six. I think this is going to be the main deck. Uh, this thing isn't too high, I think. It certainly doesn't look too high on there. Yet, yeah, this is the main deck. So these are the railings. At least the start of them. These little trapezoid things keep you together somewhat. See? And the second one on top. And you to keep them together. Two by three. Where are you going? You on top of that even? Okay, not gonna <laughs> show us any... No? Okay. Yeah, I think this is going to be the figurehead. Or part of it. You go here, okay? Specifically a left open gap in the middle for that to stick into. And then we're having more of these. Let's see. Okay, and then this to the back. Come on. There we go. Okay. It's pretty good from the front. But what are these? Okay. Okay, where are these going? Okay, you're going in there as extra securements. Yeah, I should probably go over my cabling sometime to make sure of things. Okay, bit tricky there. There and there and there. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's so simple but so nice as well, anyway. And yeah, that's just for the other sides. Okay. Another bag done. And oh, okay. That I see. This little thing supports it whilst it's extended. Okay. Another photo, here's another bag done. Come on. Oop. <laughs> I don't need to drop this thing. Okay. Put you back together again. And grab the next bag. It's starting to take good, some good shape. So, much else has been going on over in the States there. Okay. 
Um, let's see these little guys. You are looking outwards. And this thing. Oh, two of you. Okay. Pardon? There we go. Haven't watched news in a long time, okay. Yeah, sometimes it is the best to uh, not be too aware of everything that's been going on, especially with uh, things in Afghanistan at the moment. Yeah, people say that ignorance is bliss, and uh, yeah, it, it makes living through a lot better. When you don't have the weight of the world trying to weigh down on your shoulders. Again, I'm not interested in a subscription site. The whole reason that I'm, I'm listening to this is because I don't want to pay. You. Ah, uh, this is going to be Bowser's face. <laughs> Of course, his own face would be the, uh, the, 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 what is the word again? I used it earlier. Yeah. There. You got on the other side. One, two. Audiobooks, you blue, but Twitch is my media. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Here and here. And then this up top with these two for eyebrows, I'm guessing. Or sort of. Oop. A whole bunch of small stuff. You two on the sides. So there's something nice about just seeing things come together, huh? Yeah, some of these royalty free songs have vocals in them. Not too many of them though. Which might actually be for the better. Yes, yeah, so it, it makes it easier to listen to. <laughs> and you go there. This song could probably be taken pretty creepily. I've been in this house for a year and a half. I still haven't installed my TV antenna. Okay. Uh, like, uh, you have to install it personally, or 
there is it just uh, not being being installed by whoever should Teeth, and uh, not that. You are probably going there. So I'm putting you in place early. Let's see these at the end. And then these two here. And yeah, like I said. Yeah, well, the big one needs to be on the outside. There we go. The nose. There we go. Then this piece and this one. And that is the nose. Or at least the bridge of the nose. And there's the nose. <laughs> Looking pretty good so far. Though we... Yeah, with, with eyes like that, it's a bit uh, goofy. Okay. And here come the eyebrows, I think. Yep, no, just the eyes and the eyebrows. Okay. And yeah, then he suddenly looks a lot less goofy. Yeah, the figurehead, and this time I did remember the name. There we go. Probably personally, but I've been wanting to get an antenna tower to mount it to. Okay. And nothing on top. Okay. And what is this going to be? This is... I'm guessing this is going to be his hair. No, no it's just to secure it in place. There we come. Yeah, over here we we get a uh, let's see how what would the wording be? Uh, we get our TV through the same cabling as the internet, which is uh, well in the ground. And of course, that that makes it a lot more protected. But if one thing goes out, uh, typically everything else goes out as well. Then, so uh, yeah, pros and cons to everything. Okay, goes on top. Oop. Make sure you connect. There we go. And more connection pieces. And then those three are left over. Yeah, well, that was a bit early for it to go to that. Unfortunately, my internet is DLC L Pro 25.3. Okay. Yeah, that's one big problem I uh, I hear constantly over there in the states. That uh, yeah, providers typically have a, a complete yeah, either almost no competition or just complete monopolies. Which means that uh, yeah, they can give you shit. They can give you as crappy a service as they like, because, yeah, there's nobody else to go to. I could send these pictures to my friends as we do this, but probably better to just send them one at a time. Or not all at once. Okay. Bag number nine, closing in towards the end, and we are nearing two hours as well. 
Yeah, Monopoly is you and your lady. Yeah. The state should get, go uh, Monopoly busting again. Though then again, that, that's a Dutchman saying that. So not much that I can do to contribute. Yeah, almost never any infrastructure improvement again because, yeah, you have no one else to turn to, so, yeah. When it's either shit or nothing, yeah, you're forced to take shit. Ugh. The funny thing is that I'm, according to an extra histories series lately recently that was about union busting in the states uh, or it, uh, ironically i think it actually made the uh, the companies more money afterwards need to they're going to have to compete with starlink soon starlink starlink i've heard of that but it's not ringing an active bell in my head and again there's not many bells active here Space as Musk. Oh, hmm. Yeah, I'll have to wait for any more concrete evidence with that because Musk has been uh, iffy with things, especially that uh, Hyperloop stuff. Uh, that that was Musk, I I think so. Hmm. Yeah, Musk has some uh, big ideas, a lot of which he is plain stolen from people. But it doesn't mean they're always good ideas. Okay, and a bunch of these. Pardon? It's actually been a while since I ate, so it shouldn't be as burpy. Still am, because yeah, biology likes to say fuck you to people. And I moved them all up. One, two, late. There. Okay, big boy. Wait, you in the middle? Yes, that's the middle. Yeah, I think one of the things Musk was working on, well, quote-unquote working on late recently, was uh, basically a subway system for cars, and all he ended up making after huge promises and such was, yeah, a bunch of underground tunnels. So yeah, Sir Tank is, tends to be a bit of a blowhard. Let's see, those have been getting Starlink are greatly benefiting, though it's only in beta states. Okay. That is good to hear. And yeah, if he can if he can stomp on the toes of some monopolies, then I'd say go for it. Let's see, another double. Probably going to start with these. Yep. Uh, where is there's your rudder? These two. I'm guessing it's some sort of a uh, satellite it's, uh, uh, internet perhaps or so. Since a lot of the states uh, lacks in landlines, to my knowledge, which is limited on the states. So I could be completely wrong there. Is it somewhat ironic that we're talking about infrastructure whilst I'm building something? So, I think I still lack of somewhat of an understanding what irony is typically, is especially, is supposed to mean. I... Hmm. Okay, yeah, that's your double. 
And I just put both of you at the end here. Okay, this this is probably going to be the end uh, over here. Okay, big one. And I'm guessing this is going to get mirrored, so I might as well start with the other as well. Let's move you over here for a bit. Let's see, the conventional satellite internet providers tried suing and basically got laughed out of the court because, of course. Yeah, they, they've been sitting on their asses for who knows how long. So, yeah, they've gotten complacent and fat. So, yeah. When the, the young hair shows up, it's going to outrun them. Oh, well, yeah, screw them. Yeah. Basically, all I've ever heard about ISPNs in the States is that, uh, yeah, they just don't... They're just completely exploiting people. And also just plain illegal uh, illegality by uh, yeah, colluding with each other. Basically having divided states up into their own little fiefdoms of uh, we, if we don't get, if you don't compete with us here, we won't compete with you there and such. Which I'm pretty sure is just completely illegal because it's cartel forming or something. Probably got the terminology wrong, but yeah, they, they just need a they just need a big kick in the ass. Yeah, services can't compete with Starlink speeds. Okay. Yeah, again, they they got lazy. And though I, ha I though I will admit that I do not like Musk pers myself. I don't know him personally, of course. Uh, but yeah, it, again, if he can be a if he can be a, a bigger pest to uh, yeah bigger pests, then I'd say uh, let him go at it. And I'm guessing these four are going to be at the back here. First, though, these. Same on the other side. One hundred and fifty slash thirty is a pretty good starting point for services. Okay. No, uh, one fifty thirty bit. <laughs> and there we go. Another piece done. But let's not take a photo because it's not really something on its own. It's big as a bit smaller. Uh, yeah, competition is typically what drives uh, you know, innovation with things. And so yeah, if people don't have competition, yeah, they get like me and grow fat and lazy. So I have been losing weight. I'm in the double digits of kilograms again. Let's put you over there. Way with you. I'd have to. I'll have to take a look at how our internet is going. I actually should move. I should with my phone. I should move over to a different provider because my current provider hasn't been honoring my uh, mobile data stuff and such. I, I keep buy, I I I buy prepaid. I don't like subscriptions personally. Uh, but yeah, every time I try to use on the just network data for, uh, they just stiff me on it. Say so it has run out somehow without me actually using it. Probably some uh, bull expiration dates or something. And yeah, 
You, luckily, I don't use uh, mobile data and such. Demo typically, usually I just use uh, my phone and such on Wi-Fi. But still, in emergency case, it would be better to have than have not. Currently, the satellites can't talk to each other, so any sat you connect has to be in range on a ground-based station. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it's working similar to radio towers, sort of, at the moment. Or yeah, it's it's basically that radio towers. But in reverse, I think. Instead of the radio tower receiving broadcast from a satellite and sending it to your radio, it's your com your computer connecting to the uh, yeah, to the tower to send connect to the state to the satellites. Let's see these four. Let's move you a little bit, and then three flats. There we go. Okay, show yourself. I wonder what we're going to hang on the back here. He says as he peeks to the box, but can't see what is on the back of the ship on the box. As opposed to start launching satellites, they can talk to each other soon. Okay. Hopefully they'll launch those things better than they have their uh, reusable rockets land, because 9 out of 10 of those explode, to my knowledge. Okay. Oh, four lanterns. Okay. Simple enough. One, two, three, four. Okay. I should play Mario games again some, uh, soon. Maybe stream one or two of them. So far I've only been streaming PC games, but I have a, a capture card in my Switch at the moment. So I could stream... Uh, yeah. Anything that has an HDMI connect, uh, connector. That hasn't been true for SpaceX in years. Um, maybe I'm thinking of something else then? I'm not sure. It has been a while since I've heard of any of that happening. It, it... There we go. This is going to get mirrored on the other side. That's as good as certain. Did I bump the camera there? Sorry if I did. Okay, okay decoration pieces. No, it, that one has not on it as well. Okay. And these two. Okay, and then we get mirror it on the other side. Yes, we do. Okay. Nearly every single stage they've wanted to land has, for a long time, been watching every lo and f you know, video for years. Okay, I'll have to double check uh, where I'd last heard of that, though. Hmm. Let's see. 
this is going to get mirrored, so I might as well put it together for the other side. Okay. And then a one by two with a hole. Just in case we're miscommunicating, I was t uh, talking about uh, the landing ships, not launching ones, or the launching the landing rockets, not launching rockets. to remember to keep this in sight. Let's see, they've had several failures for the Starship, but it's still in early development. It's not in surface vehicle, yeah. Uh, you don't want something in surface that has a tendency to blow up. This is going to make the rudder, I'm pretty sure. Let's see these two on top of each other. And then I'm guessing all of the gray ones. No, not yet. One blue through here. Hmm. Is that it for the rudder? Bit small. Let's see. Through there. And that connects like that. Yep. Okay. Okay, it's not actually, is that, the, yeah, it doesn't really matter if it's the rudder or not. Okay, that's there for securing. And that can connect to the back rest of the ship now. Okay, then these are just going to make extra brackets to connect to then. And we are we missing one of the black pieces. Nope, we have four. I miscalculated. Let's see, they've launched more rockets than NASA or Russia has. I think in nearly everyone, they've tried to uh, land on the link part or drone ship on the, has landed properly for several... I'll, I'll need to double check where I found that because from what I heard, a lot of uh, space act or lost a, a lot of some space uh, companies uh, uh, rockets had a tendency to blow up still. On landing, that is. Or maybe maybe it was just an old video that I ran across. Okay. You are going to connect to, to which of these, actually? The first of these. Okay. Get, get in there. There. And the same for you here. Okay, that is going into the third hole as well. Okay, there we go. One boxy lock extendable ship. It could be that starship, maybe. 
Okay. Getting pretty big now. But still actually of a pretty manageable size for storage. Like I, I have no real space up on the shelves there anymore, but I do have plenty of space over there on a cloth. In the closet that one of the cats used to sleep on but since then she got her own little basket or rather it's supposed to be a basket but she she sleeps on it when it's folded up on the side hmm. we have an ugly gap in between but there's probably something going to be done about that first off though another photo Okay, no need to flash. Okay. Come on. Back to this. Okay. And on to bag number 11. And we're in two hours now. Okay. A bit more filled. More than likely, it's the Bezos or one of the other companies trying to develop their own systems. It's been a while since I saw that video, so it could have been any of them. And yeah, my memory is notoriously bad. Or at least I consider it to be notoriously bad. <clears throat> Or rather, it's more that my memory is notoriously specific. Sometimes it'll pick up details, but overlook the whole picture. And otherwise, other times it picks up the, the big picture, but none of the details. Okay, now it wants the big plate here. Let's see. One, two, three... Four, six, and I see seven. I'm putting you aside for whatever you are. And then it's at the ends of these. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be the floor of the cabin at the back here. Once that's in place, I won't be able to you know, hold it over there anymore. Unless this thing is going to be made in its entirety and then... I think I bumped it again there. Let's see. SpaceX Falcon Action Dragon Capsules are human space flight rated by NASA now. Okay. Let's see. One, two, only two of each, okay. And that's three of, that's three, okay. One, two, three, okay. One, two, and Three. Okay, what's of this? Let's see, one of those lip things. Well, there you are. Okay, and the little grabbers. One, two, and a flat black. Okay. In fact, there's a SpaceX Dragon capsule at the International Space Station right now, having ferried crew there a while back. Okay. I actually have... Uh, you, you can probably somewhat see it by the orange. There's the LEGO International Space Station up there. I'm thinking about hanging that thing from the ceiling at some point. Uh, I'll, I'm, have, I'm thinking about hanging a few of these from the ceiling.
it's again. Let's see, four of these. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be the back of the cabin, I think. Oh, let's see. Two of these weird little ones, and then four of the bigger grabbers. There's one, there's two. Okay. Let's see. Falcon S, Falcon 9 rocket and crew Dragon capsule are the only USA human authorized transportation providers to orbits. Okay. Let's see. It's starting to get a bit dark, I think. Let's see. Hmm. Hope that isn't. Yeah, it's a bit late to start with that two hours in, but might as well give it a bit of a shot. Let's see, there and there. And more of these wobbly things. There and arches. Hmm. Wait, did I misplace those? Ah, no, I see. I was looking at it wrong. These go here. And these go here. Okay. Come on. Yeah, there we go. One of them wasn't cooperating. There. There, and then two little bits that I'm not overlooking this time. Let's see. A long one and two of these one by fours. There you are. Okay, now we're doing something separate again for a bit. Okay, brought her against it. Two by three and a ramp. Wait, a purple? Oh no, brown. Okay. Sometimes the colors come off a bit weird in these. And yeah, that's uh, brown. More. It's not can't be see, really seen on the screen here since a bit too much light from it. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Away with the subscription request again. Okay. Push it through a bit more and then flatten against a flat surface to make sure it's perfectly in place. Mm -hmm. There, and now all of this comes together, but what is it really forming? There you are. And then, of course, this one at the other end. Power block. Isn't it supposed to say power at both sides? Okay, a little deviation. And this one on top. Okay. And 
that all goes in here. Okay. On top of these little footholds. Let's see. Blue Origin and Virgin Galactic recently took a couple of people suborbital, not quite reaching outer space. United Launch Alliance is still blowing up rockets on the pad, I heard. Could be that it was them that I heard of again. Let's see. One by three. Secure you in place. So it's a bit more difficult to get them off. The rest of the blocks. Okay. Of these and one of these okay this is going on mirrored I th for the moment let's see this one needs to go one order one that's there hmm. okay what are we making now then One of the grey ones, which move more easily than the black ones. Okay. Oh, wrong way around with this. Yeah, other way. There we go. Oop. And again, I bump into this thing's... I should put in a counter. I have a bunch of these on the one stick. Okay, two stubs. Okay, and then this there. Okay, and that goes in there. Wait, that's hanging loose at the moment because now we're making the other side of that. Okay, one of you, one of you. And wait. Okay, that's not how... Oh, it's going to be moved into place in a bit, probably. There. And yeah, then the rest is built around it. One, one, and one. No, oh, there's two of these. Okay. One. Two. Three. And four. Okay, cornerstones. Hmm. Wait, did I? Oh, those need to go back one. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, those are in the correct position. Two of these. Two of these. There and there. Two of these weird trapezoid ones. There's your other. Let's see. Jeff Bezos, Amazon, rode his high member, uh, his member shaped rocket recently. Not quite high enough for proper outer space. Yet uh, they said that people, uh, they said that they sent a huge dick up in a ship shaped like a dick. There were plenty of people uh, asking him for not to come back down. And I believe that also the youngest Dutch, the youngest uh, astronaut ever, astronauts, because they didn't go into or real orbits, 
Uh, yeah, they had the youngest passenger to go up that high in there as well, I think. That was Bezos. Yeah. Let's see, one of the uh, two of those. And then two of the double grabbers. There, there, and there. Uh, these. And this one. Okay, sealing this off quite well. There, there, one, two, three, four. Okay, one, two, three, and, and yeah, then he had the audacity after the fact to say that uh, the workers all paid for it because, yeah, he, he doesn't pay them. Jackass went to space over the back of everyone working for him. Let's see. Get, no, wrong. Okay. Uh, he did pay for it, but he did so with money that uh, he he practically stole from his workers because he pays them practically yeah, nothing or far from a livable wage from all I've been hearing. Under circumstances that would be considered inhuman in other places. Or inhumane would be the correct words. Like, no bathroom breaks allowed and such, or so. Been a bit since I've heard directly of that, so again, could be working with old information. Though knowing them, they'd, uh, they'd be very, very, very slow to implement changes that would actually benefit the workers. Which is why they especially should unionize, especially since they were sabotaging their efforts to unionize. As one of the things I heard of that was that uh, they suddenly installed a PO box across from right across from where the uh, meetings were being held, uh, with a camera installed at it, aimed directly at where those meetings would be held, so they could identify anyone going there. So uh, yeah, scum. From what I've heard. Amazon, the Amazon workers are going for a second attempt at unionizing, especially, especially because all of that bullshit. Okay, and that's this done. I'll put you in place up here. Let's not push too hard. Hmm, something clicked together there. Okay, photo time. There we go, much easier transition. Yeah, this is look. This is coming out real good with this thing. Something that yeah, one of Bowser's eyes came loose. Keep your eye on a prize. Okay, one extra black piece, black connector piece. Black into last bag. Uh, 
Now, speaking of unions, I actually don't think this probably applies with unions. Uh, yeah, I I think there's been calls again for people in the gaming industry to unionize again. Especially after all this shit with uh, Activision that bubbled up to the surface with Activision Blizzard. Hmm. Okay. Come on, get on that. Let's see. A two beat side and an arch. There's a reason unions were created, even uh, if for the most part uh, they are not needed. I'd say they definitely are needed. Because, uh, yeah, you you're, you probably already are aware of exploitation that goes on in some uh, companies. Let's see. This little bit there to even it out. Uh, yeah, basically it came, uh, it was brought up, it came bubbling up that uh, people in Activision Blizzard have been uh, sexually harassing uh, women for years there. With, uh, yeah, the PR teams, yeah, well, basically doing what you'd expect from a big corp PR teams and shielding the uh, perpetrators and retaliating against the victims. They even had, they even had, uh, when they'd had uh, have company excursions or something, uh, or big meetings at certain places, they'd have, uh, some of the people in higher up, they would uh, set up something called the Cosby Suites. Uh, yeah, where, yeah, where they'd hang up a picture of, uh, yeah, Cosby, even though he has been uh, cleared of all, of criminal charges recently. No, no, well, not cleared. He's been released on tech because of technicality, sort of. Hmm. But uh, yeah, that, that was all started after it, all of the stories about him started coming off. So they were literally naming one of their rooms where they would go and bring women up uh, after an alleged uh, rapist. Which is not a good uh, image for, especially when it's the public relationships people in there. Uh, yeah, there are there there is a class action uh, going against them. Actually, there's multiple uh, lawsuits going against Blazers. For one, there is the a class action, I think, and then there's the uh, then there's the more fun one, which is the shareholders are suing them for lying against them. And when the shareholders are getting pissy with some people, uh, that's when you know you need to duck and cover. So I, I don't, I, I very much doubt that it would kill Activision Blizzard, but seeing how as they've been going in the last ten years or so, especially with the Warcraft Three reforged you know, stuff, I don't think many people would actually miss them. Okay. Yeah, these are going to be railings. Come on, get on there. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be something fun that we'll probably be hearing off for the coming years. Let's see. Oh, French tune. Yeah, and immediately the, the audio drops. Let's see. You go there. You go across. Come on, get on. Another one of you on top. And one of these little slides. Oh, uh, see through pieces. One, two, three. And then three of these. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, there's actually four of the red ones, or more purple brownish. I'm never good at naming colors. 
Especially once you start mixing them in more together. Okay. Let's just correct these a little bit so they are a bit more straight in comparison with the rest of it. There we go. And luckily, we're not dealing with any stickers with this. Because that would be a, a nuisance to get into place. Come on, every time I start to bop to this music, it drops in volume. <laughs> uh, yeah, probably specifically de designed to annoy people into getting a subscription. Creating a problem and then offering a solution to it. That people have to pay for. There we go. This is probably all going to get mirrored in a bit on the other side with the rest of the bits. Uh, let's see this one. And then this at the very top. And that's just this, this ring done, I'm guessing. Actually, no. Oh, come on. That is, <laughs> that's insultingly easy. I don't even need to see instructions for that. Okay, where are these going? Over here. And here. Okay. I'm guessing this is the outside then, which makes sense. Yeah, it's going there. Three of these lanterns. Might as well make them all now. But uh, yeah, things are interesting in recent days. That can certainly be said. I think... Uh, I'm not sure if it's a Japanese or a Chinese saying. But... Uh, I think... A sort of curse there would be to... Yeah. To hope that someone would live in interesting times. And of course, on its surface, that sounds like a good thing, but uh, then you also realize that interesting can mean a lot of different things. Like, a, yeah, World War II could be called an quote-unquote interesting time. And I don't think a lot of people alive would want to have been alive during all of that. Okay. Now I'll line you two up. I have to connect this a bit blind. There we go. Oh, nope. I missed. Okay. There we go. Securely in place, and all of this is going to mirror that. Okay. Let's try and speed through this a bit. And not that one, this one. And not those. Putting those aside though for later. Two. Pardon again. As my stomach is complaining right, to tell me to go eat something, because it's starting to approach, uh, ev evening is starting to approach. Uh, yeah, it shouldn't take too long anymore to finish this up, because we're, well, we're through this bag, more than halfway through this bag, and then there's only one remaining. This and this. May you live in interesting times, yeah. 
And yeah, backhanded compliments and curses are the best. Because it takes... Pe uh, dumb people will not get it that you are, uh, well, backhanding them. Now, speaking of dumb people, uh, there's a show I watch, uh, a web show I watch, uh, called uh, What the uh, Fuck is Wrong with You? That has been hosted for uh, nearly or over a decade now. And basically what that does is they take stupid stories throughout the week and then compile them. Or they they show off a few. Starting to consider breakfast too. Yeah, go ahead and go make, get that or make it uh, if you want to. I wouldn't want you to go hungry whilst trying to watch me. But uh, yeah, basically it's the stupid news of the of the last week. And one of the one of the <laughs> uh, stories this time was uh, especially stupid, if you ask me. Uh, apparently, there's been a shortage with uh, trading card games, and some dumb asses, an actual group of them. So it would be a good idea to steal a bunch of cards from a store and then uh, return to try and sell them back to them. Not once, but twice. Yeah, they sent two, when they sent their first idiot to try and sell them those cards or some of those cards, they sent in a second one, which they also caught. <laughs> Only eight, 11 hours ago. Uh, yeah, for me, that would be a very long time. <laughs> Then again, I'm I'm uh, pretty fat here, so I'd probably be uh, eas much easier to roll around. So. Oh, you're not going anywhere. Okay. You on top. What are these going to be for, actually? Or just they just just decoration handholds? Usually only have two meals a day. Okay. Yeah, it'd be difficult to eat uh, on the roads uh, when you're mo when you constantly need to be moving. Hmm. And then again, I also have a habit of snacking, which of course isn't helping with me lose, trying to lose weight. But I have been managing to lessen with it. Okay. You. You. Should hold that more to the side here. There and there. And it's these two again. Okay, it depends on what you're trying to eat. And yeah, you, you probably also have much bigger meals than I do. Personally, I've been personally I've been using uh, meal bars as part of a, an attempted diet. Uh, not the only thing I'd eat, of course. And we have one little purple bit left. Okay. These are all instructions that we've seen before. So let's get this into place. If I can see. There we go. And we're almost done. Some things are easier than others since I'm going to need the right technique, yeah. It's a lot easier to eat a sandwich than a bowl of ramen, or for comparison. Okay. And last but not least... Not unlucky number 13. Okay. It's probably going to be mostly the deck or something. Or, well, the mass by the look of it. Okay. 
Sí. And the both of you in the box for the trash. All of you together. Let's see you. Black hinged piece with cyan green. Oh, already one of these. Okay. Then one of those at the back. Okay. Stub pieces on the side. by four hmm. and out oh, there you are okay yeah, I'm guessing it's going to be open mostly soups can be done by drinking out of a cup of some kind sandwiches should be made uh, with as few loose ingredients as possible of course yeah <laughs> you don't want to have your chickens flying off if, if you hit a bump or something hmm. Now I want to go to Subway for a chicken sandwich, but we're we're approaching evening, so dinner will be coming anyways. I'll sneak out to get that tomorrow, probably. Now, Subway makes pretty good uh, sandwiches. And pretty cheap if you hit the daily uh, uh, deal. Mm-hmm. This one there. And then these little bits. Now, is this is going to be Bowser's head again, I'm guessing. And it looks like it. There and there. Hmm. Personally, I've taken a bit of a liking to uh, uh, sandwiches with banana, peanut butter, and uh, sambal, which is in uh, east in or eastern around Indonesia and such uh, hot sauce. Personally, I typically like hot sauce with a lot of things. Because I'm a spice fiend. Okay. Horns. I have no idea where it is. It's going to be stuck, though. Okay. Eyebrows. And eyes. Nose. And then the flat place is probably going here. Oh, not yet. Hmm. I'm not seeing a second of it. Yeah, it's probably going to go onto this one here. Like that. Oh, very likely. I'm going to leave that there. Because... No, not yet, again. Oh, oh, that's an extra right piece. Okay, need to go anyways. To make room for these to be placed. Then you go back, yep, and eyebrows go into place. <laughs> and there we go. Another Bowser head, which is going on the back of the ship, okay. Come on, go in there. There we go. Okay. 
And I think we're in the last stretch. Yeah, three times. Let's see, a good thick sauce or spread can help glue loose ingredients, but you don't want so much sauces that it will squeeze or run out. Just enough to fl for flavor is key. Yeah. Like you get that a lot with hamburgers that you if you, you squeeze it together and then just Speaking of, we have a very, very good hamburger joint uh, nearby. It's, it's, it's li their specialities are rib burgers and ribs, and their name is literally Burgers and Ribs. <laughs> but the ones they make are really good. Like Angus beef uh, and such. Okay, cannons. Probably repeat it on the other side as well. Okay, there you go. And let's see, we have three more of those, so those are going to get mirrored. Finger foods are far easier than utensil foods. The main thing you want uh, things you can easily eat without having to pay a lot of attention to the eating process and can be eaten with, uh, with only one hand. Yeah, because you need to be driving and focusing on the road. <laughs> yeah, I guess those meal bars that I eat uh, uh, for breakfast and lunch would count for that, but they are... They, Maybe I've just grown used to the taste, but they're pretty bland. Okay, and that is all six. Wait, did I miss... Oh, wait, this... Is that going to notice? Okay, that, that is going on top of it. Okay. For a moment I thought, where the heck are the, the masts? Okay, what are these last pieces for then? Yes, we've already seen the cannons. Yes, and then we have the flaps before. Hmm. Come on. Hmm. Okay, there has to be some. Yes, there we go. What is this going to be then? There's not enough pieces for a flag left. Pardon, again. Oh. <laughs> okay. Also depends on your multitasking ability. Driving has to be the priority, of course. Never let other things distract you from that responsibility. If they will, pull over and stop somewhere safe. Yeah. Safety of you and the cargo. Especially you. As much as the companies would probably want to it otherwise. Yes, yes. Safety takes priority. And that's it for the build, it seems. Okay. Yes. Yeah, this is where things get put together. So, what was? Why did these get put together then? Okay. All right. How are you all going to click together? If the instruction would load. Get lost with your subscription offers. 
Yeah, your safety and the others around you are priority. Okay. Yeah, it opens up. Okay, then we put the main sail in. Let's see. Is this is this waggly bit finally going to connect to anything then? Or is that just going to waggle? Okay, the claw. Because Bowser is just absolutely obsessed with his own face and hands. Close it up around. And then this one. Oh yeah, that's where these little spaces are for. Yeah. <laughs> oh, keep you in place. And then these two. Yeah, the, the people who design these things are pretty freaking clever. And then these secure both halves together. There we go. And just for a little bit extra, the captain up front. And then I'll just put these with the other extra bits. And yeah, that's the entire Bowser's airship built. <laughs> yeah, pretty cool looking if you ask me. Uh, probably should have taken a few more photos there, actually. Uh. Okay, then. All right, then. Thank you for watching. Anyone who has been watching, uh, you have anything further to say, Trucker? Also, thank you as well for watching. Okay, now to send these to my friends. Let's see them. Hmm. Are you having that? Hmm. It's a bunch of bots in there again, I think. <laughs> Keep the roads responsible, be they on the ground or in the air. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, like I said, I don't think I'll make this a common thing, if any, because I, I simply don't have the space to keep putting these things down, unless I start hanging them from the ceiling. And uh, yeah, a, a, a set has to also get my interest. Like, a bunch of Star Trek... Uh, not Star Trek, there's no LEGO Star Trek. That totally should be LEGO Star Trek, if you ask me. But a lot of LEGO Star Wars sets just don't interest me, because the vehicles look boring to me. But, uh, yeah... Again, thanks for watching, and uh, no, I'll see anyone who gets <laughs> it. I'll see anyone who has any further interest in me some other time. But as always, until then, until then. Now to reach in here to actually reach my hotkeys, making me look like a fool on camera even more. <laughs> <laughs>